All right, here we go. Gonna test some stuff out. Gonna do a video about updating to iOS 7 and the problems people have been having with uh, updating. For example, if you try to just update it, you'll probably run into an error, uh, probably just get stuck on some loading screen on your phone. Um, so I'm gonna talk about how to get around that, the possible errors you might run into, or the one error you might run into several times. Um, I had to restore my phone about four times before it actually took, but no worries, um, I'm sure I can get you through this. And if you have any questions, I'll definitely reply. Just leave comments below. All right, one thing you wanna make sure you do before you get started is you wanna back up your phone. So you wanna open iTunes. If there's an update, I highly suggest updating iTunes before you do anything else. Uh, in the top right corner, you'll see iPhone over here. And that's what you'll wanna click on. It may say something else, but usually it says iPhone if that's what you're updating. Um, you wanna make sure that you're backing it up to this computer. You can use iCloud if you want to, but I suggest using the computer. Um, it's faster, especially when you're putting everything back on, it's faster rather than relying on like Wi-Fi. Um, so I back up, I check the box, um, this computer, make sure you put your password in on your phone so that iTunes can access it all. Um, so then once you've done that, you wanna click backup now right here you just click back up now and then it'll start backing up your phone you can see it up here it's backing up loading don't try and update or anything until this bar has completed it's really fast for mine just because it's already been backed up like very recently so wait until that bar is done another thing you want to do if you want the computer to back up your applications you want to hit alt and then it'll give you this little menu here go to file devices and then transfer purchases you click on that and what that'll do it didn't do anything for mine because they're already done but what that'll do is that'll start transferring the apps from your phone to your computer you may have to enter in your apple id and password to do that mine's already authorized on this computer so i don't have to do that you can see i'm on ios 7.0 i put that on there last night so make sure you back it up before you do anything else you can do it with an update. Uh, you could try it that way, but I tried that way with my iPad and it ended up giving me errors anyways. So I had to restore it like three times before it went through in several different ways, which I'll have links to all of that um, in my uh, video, in, the, in this tutorial. I'll have links to you know how to put it, your phone in DFU mode, how to put it into recovery mode, and how to try and restore from both. Um, <clears throat> And basically, you may end up with the um, phone stuck loading. So basically, you're trying to update or restore, and the phone will just get stuck. You'll get the Air 14 through iTunes, and then your the phone will get stuck with this loading bar. And you'll see it on the screen right now. Um, that'll that's what it's going to look like. And then there's nothing left. The phone doesn't do anything else. It may reboot by itself, but I didn't you know wait for it because if iTunes isn't doing anything, your phone's not going to do anything. So what I did from that point is I put it in DFU mode. I'll have a link to my DFU mode video in, in the description and above um, in a little quote box. And you can click there. You can watch how to put it in DFU mode and then restore it from DFU mode with iTunes. If you get another error again, um, you can put it in recovery mode. It's very simple to put it in recovery mode. You hold home and power together at the same time. Hold it for 45 seconds, 60 seconds. Just keep holding. Eventually, it'll turn off. It'll turn back on. Keep holding. Even if you see the Apple logo, keep holding until you see the iTunes logo with a USB cable. Then you're in recovery mode. Try and restore it that way. Um, I had to restore it four times. So you may have to keep doing this over and over again until it takes. One thing I did do, close iTunes, shut down the computer, turn it back on put it back in recovery or DFU mode and try and restore it one more time. Eventually it will take, sooner or later it will take. But that's why I'm making this video is because if you've given up, if you're having troubles with your phone or whatever, there is a solution. I went through the same trouble, just be persistent and it'll work out. Um, this is the iTunes logo, so this is what it has to look like if you have it in recovery mode with the iTunes logo. And then basically once you have it in recovery mode or DFU mode, close iTunes, open iTunes, hit the restore iPhone button Right here you see restore iPhone, just click that right there and then, you know, um, interesting. And um, it won't let me restore the phone because find my iPhone's on, that's cool, okay, anyways. Thanks guys.